41 games he started, you know, I mean, Jesus, true shooting percentage over 60, and he's shooting just under 50 from the floor and 43 something from three. You know, averaging like 12 and a half points very efficiently. So he's been really good. Luke and uh, Stanley are good players with, you know, good, uh, bring a lot to the table, but they both got to take a step forward long term. I'm just looking since, since Bullock became starter, December 12, full time starter, December 12. Among starters in the NBA with more than three three point attempts, he is behind Curry and Durant only. Yeah, no, he, look, he's played really well. And, I mean, to me, that's not even the best part of his game. It's his movement without the ball, it's the fact that he doesn't turn the ball over, he doesn't make a lot of defensive mistakes. I mean, it's a lot of things with him. He's just a very, uh, a very efficient player, not flashy. Um, you know, not going to go for 35 or 40, but just pretty consistent and uh, not going to make many mistakes and going to make the right play at both ends of the floor more often than not. You might not care about this, uh, especially right now, but like the essence of the most improved award, like should he be in consideration, do you think? For this? I think he should be, absolutely. Yeah. But I don't think he's a big enough name right. probably, but, yeah. uh, but absolutely he should be. You're talking about a guy who'd never played over, what, 500 minutes and now has developed into a uh, solid and efficient starter. I mean, that's a hell of a big jump uh, in a year, and he should definitely be in the uh, mix for that. When's the earliest you can pick up that uh, option on him? Uh, yeah, well, we have until – we have him unless we get rid of him, and we're not going to do that. So. Well, yeah, I mean, the thing is with him, I mean, he still can get better defensively, but he's not going to make many mistakes. Like, there's not going to be game plan mistakes and things like that. He's locked in, and he really helps you play well offensively, even when he's not getting a lot of shots. He's going to move without the ball. He's going to space the floor. He's not going to turn it over. I mean, he just really knows how to play.